In this video, I'm going to show you step-by-step -step how to create a safe folder to download programs into that won't be bothered or interfered with with your antivirus or firewall programs. First thing you want to do is right-click anywhere on desktop. This is Windows 10, but the directions are the same for all versions of Windows. Right-click, New Folder. What you want to do is give that folder a name. Let's say, for example, Scrapers Bot. Then what you want to do is you want to tell your antivirus and firewall programs, any security programs, to leave this folder alone. That anything that you download into here is safe and to not bother scanning or preventing the proper operation of the software program. And of course, how you do this is going to vary depending, depending upon which version of Windows you have, which antivirus programs you have. And you want to go to the web page that is being displayed on your screen now. It provides complete step-by-step -step instructions for how to whitelist a folder within most all antivirus programs that exist. That URL will take you to this page. You click this link here, and then you're going to see instructions for pretty much every single antivirus program in existence. All you do is find the antivirus that you have on your computer and follow the step-by-step -step instructions. Now specifically for Windows 10, we're going to click the start button and type in antivirus and threat protection. Click virus and threat protection. Virus threat protection settings. Exclusions. Add or remove exclusions. Then you click add exclusion folder then navigate to that folder. There it is. And you're done with the Windows antivirus. Now what you're going to do is go to the URL where the file is or program you want to download and download it into that folder. Because you told your security software to leave that folder alone, you shouldn't have any issues. Now you may or may not get this warning about a software program being dangerous. That is because a lot of our software programs happen to contain code that manipulates websites in the background, depending upon what software program you're downloading, such as Long Tail Keyword Scraper or POF Auto Message Sender. Click this arrow here, click the menu item Keep, then double click that original folder you created. You're going to see your download in it. It's a zip file. Right click it, extract all, and you're going to extract it to the same folder. Now you can delete the zip. Double click the folder, left click to select the software program, right click for the context menu, and run as administrator. Now if you get this setting here, it's because you didn't approve the specific software program. So you can click run anyway and then the software program should run fine for you. Now, if for some reason it doesn't, what you want to do then is you want to click the Start button, type Firewall, Firewall and Network Protection, allow an app through the firewall, and then you are going to click Change Settings, allow another app, browse to that folder, and select the program, Add. Now you have added the exception for that software program. Okay, 